In 1856, an 18-year-old chemist named William Henry Perkin accidentally created the world's first synthetic dye while attempting to synthesize quinine as a treatment for malaria. This vivid purple substance, which Perkin named Movane, was the first synthetic dye that could color fabric without fading, a revolutionary discovery in a world where all dyes came from plants, insects, or minerals. Prior to mauve, purple dyes were extremely expensive and reserved for royalty and the elite. But Perkin's discovery democratized this coveted color, making it accessible to the growing middle class. The fashion world was immediately captivated, and when Empress Eugenie of France wore mauve to complement her blue eyes and Queen Victoria chose it for her daughter's wedding, the mauve mania of the 1860s was born. The commercial success of mauve inspired other chemists to create new synthetic dyes, leading to an explosion of vibrant, affordable colors that transformed the visual landscape of the Victorian era. Beyond fashion, Perkins' work established the foundation for modern organic chemistry as scientists began to understand the structure of carbon compounds and how to manipulate them systematically. The hunt for new dyes led directly to the development of the first synthetic drugs, as chemists discovered that coal tar derivatives could have medicinal properties as well as colorful ones. In recognition of his contribution to both science and industry, Perkin was knighted in 1906, 50 years after his accidental discovery that had transformed chemistry from a primarily analytical science to a creative, synthetic discipline. Today, Perkin's mauve revolution is recognized as the birth of the modern chemical industry, demonstrating how a single discovery can unexpectedly bridge art, science, and commerce, changing our world in vibrant and lasting ways.